Today we're opening the first Yu-Gi-Oh packs ever made. What's up guys, we're back with another epic video. Today we're opening a ton of old school packs, which include the first four sets ever made, Legend of Blue Eyes, Metal Raiders, Spell Ruler, Pharaoh Servant, and then some Invasion of Chaos, which are not the first, you know, five or whatever, but they're also very cool. But before that, we have a giveaway. I'll be giving away these two original print secret rares. This one has a little bit of a ding on, but we have Gaia the Dragon Champion and the Thousand Dragon. All you guys have to do is like this video, be subscribed, let me know what you want to see pulled today. We have 25 packs to open today, so hopefully we can get some really nice pulls because last time we opened some legacy packs it didn't go that well so let's hope that we can rebound a little bit these came out of target walmart blisters we've got a yellow luster shield inferno we get a ryu koki and dimension distortion all right ultra evolution pill chop man and prickle fairy so a slow start but we have a long way to go i'm i kind of want to do the pack trick today let's let's do it two three four like that i think that's the rare no Wait, is that? Yeah. Okay, we're good. Yeah, okay. Four will be good. Solemn Wishes. We got Burning Land. Reign of Mercy. Doguro Yaiba. Seven completed. Infinite Dismissal. Flame Champion. Bombardment Beetle. Monster Recovery. And nothing. We're 0 for 2 to start, but we have a long way to go. Let's go into Spell Ruler. All right, Spell Ruler. Let's do the pack trick again for a little bit of fun. A little bit of extra suspense. We've got an Eternal Rest. Performance of the Sword. Twin Long Rods number two. Umiruka. Whiptail Crow. Magical Labyrinth. Hungry Burger. And UFO Turtle and a Tailor of the Fickle. Okay, slow start. Metal Raiders, this is your chance. The first Yu-Gi-Oh packs ever made. We have Legend of Blue Eyes, Metal Raiders, Spell Ruler, which is a Magic Ruler, and Pharaoh Servant. The first four sets ever. We got Leo Gun. All 2004 sets. That's all of them. The main sets, at least. Pharaoh Imp. Yadu Kuru. Oh, we didn't do it. Wait, let's go like this. We've got the Aki Beam Stim Pack. Wing Dragon Guardian of the Fortress number one. Paralyzing Potion. Yadu Karu. Seven tools of the bandit. There's an ultra rare pull. Wow, that's that's uh that's a bummer. That could have been something really good. All the ultra rares except seven tools, magic jammer, and uh the uh, the other one. What is that? Horn of Heaven. But uh, I do like seven tools. I think it's a cool card, but it's definitely not one you're looking for. We only have one legend of blue eyes pack, so we're gonna save that for the end because I had all these other ones, but I only had the one legend of blue eyes. So let's see. Oh wait. Let's do this for a little bit of suspense. You guys know? Yeah, like that. That's good. We've got the Lord Poison, Terra King Salmon, the Salmon, Self-Destruct Button, Chaos Necromancer, Soul Tiger, Amphibious Burgoth MK3, Ojami Yellow. Oh, a secret rare invader of darkness. We're invading the darkness. Rather than getting the Chaos Ember, we are getting the Invader of Darkness, but still really cool. It's a secret rare. We will take that. Oh, okay. Definitely better opening than last time so far, though. So now we have a secret rare and an ultra rare. Not bad, actually, for how many packs we've opened. Uh, the pack trick seems to be paying off a little bit. We switched it over to the pack trick. It's actually working. We've got the inspection. We've got the Wing Weaver. Solomon's Law Book. This way, the all the commons, you know, they come before the foil, so you can respect them a little more. Deep Sea Warrior, the Mr. Volcano. We're not always going to do this, but sometimes it's fun. Minor Goblin Official. Flame Champion, especially on these old school ones where we like the commons. Bubonic Vermin, and I think that's it. Yeah, Prohibition. Okay. It's like maybe a $3 rare. That's pretty good, actually. Maybe $2 at this point. It just depends. All right, we'll take that. A decent rare. Let's see what the next pack can give us. All right, Spell Ruler, what shall you provide for the opening? So far, pretty good. Ceremonial Bell, we can show each other our hands while we play. That's such a weird card. Electric Snake, also a weird card. I always thought that this, uh, like, electric ball on it, it looks, I don't know. It, I always thought it looked kind of cool, but it also looks like 2000s uh, video games on a PC. So, Darkness Approach, we got the Commencement Dance, Hungry Burger, Whiptail Crow, and... Reliable Guardian and the Shining Angel. Okay, nothing in that one. But now we're back to the Metal Raiders, which is one for one so far. We have pulled... What was it? Seven Duels of the Bandit? Yeah. An amazing Ultra Rare. One, two, three, four. The best Ultra Rare you could possibly want. Watch, we're going to pull Horn of Heaven now. Gazelle, the King of Mythical... No, 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 Mythical Beast. Armored Lizard. Mortal of Thunder. Aki Beam. Baby Dragon. Labyrinth Tank. Dream Clown. Mystic Horseman. And... The Great, the Grande Moth. Very beautiful, the Grande Moth. Such a great pull. We will take that all day of the week. We are back to Invasion of Chaos. The Chaos will be invaded. We already have 
the uh, invader of darkness. So there's definitely some invasion going on here. We have the recycle. Skull mark to Lady Bug. Energy Drain. Curse Seal of the Forbidden Spell. Dimension Distortion. Sea Serpent Warrior of Darkness. Jade Insect Whistle. I don't know where the foil is coming either, which makes this also kind of exciting. Oh, and the Stray Lambs, because I'm so used to... I know it's like two from the back, but you can't really tell as easily when you're doing it through so many cards. Okay, Pharaoh's Servant. So that's a little bit of a change up, because now, I mean, I'm so used to it being the fourth card, it makes it a little bit more suspenseful for me. So let's see. Gamble. So we're, we're gambling on Yu-Gi-Oh packs. We're opening them up and uh, losing money. Keys to tie, but that's the way we do it. Solemn Wishes. Minor Goblin Official. Flame Champion. The Bubonic. The Vermin. Oh, Gear Free, the Iron Knight. Such a nice card, super rare. We seem to pull this guy quite a bit, but it is one of the better super rares. The Iron Knight. When an equipped card is equipped to this card, destroy the equipped card. Very exciting. Butterfly Dagger, Elma, you guys know. Spell Ruler. The Ruler of the Spell. Here we go. Can we pull something out of Spell Ruler? Have we pulled anything out of Spell Ruler? I don't know. Twin Long Rods, number two. An amphibious creature with two whip-like Tails. Very beautiful. Dark Zebra. Eternal Rest. Spear Cretin. The Taihon number two. Turtle Oath. Can we get the uh, the Crab Turtle? Liquid Beast. A liquid life form that thrives in water. On water. Not in water. On water. Interesting. Minar. Okay. And the Giant Germ. He thrives on water. So he's just slithering around on top of the water. That's even more scary now that I think about it. Metal Raiders. Let's go. One, two, three, four. Let's do this. We have Lady Defe. Cocoon of Evolution. Can we pull the Pecanium off? De disc, not desk. Paralyzing Potion. Rainbow Flower. Ancient Lizard Warrior. Destroyer Golem. Castle of Dark Illusions. And the Elegant Egotist. Elegant Egotist. All right, that's not what we're looking for. Invasion of Chaos. The Chaos shall invade. Let's go. 25 legacy packs so far we've had pretty good pulls i would say but not the best we could possibly have which would be you know we probably you know best we could possibly have we've already not had them because we've had a pack without a foil i guess you could technically have a secret rare or something like that in every pack chaos necromancer we got the yellow luster shield inferno ryu koki dimension distortion and the Ultra Evolution pill. Let me know what you guys think would be the best pack or the best opening ever. Like, what would I, what would I have to pull? Like, 25 Ultras or, like, the best card in the set every time or something like that? Let me know what you guys think. We got the Eye of Truth. We're back to Pharaoh's Servant. Bite Shoes. The Driving Snow. Oh! Oh, we forgot to do it. We got the Nobleman of Crossout. Okay, that's very good super. I think it's around $5, even unlimited. That's a very good one. It's very cool artwork, too. It's shiny sword. I like to see that. We got the uh, Morphin Jar number two and a Darkfire Soldier number two. Honestly, I want to know whose idea it was to have, like, number two. So, like, have the same name, but just put a number two at the end. Like, is that not seem like the laziest thing ever? I don't know. It, it's sort of cool, actually, because it's, like, two different cards. They just say number two. But it's also like, really? Like, you're just going to put, like, they could have made slot machine number two. Just made a different card. Isn't that just weird? Weather report. Ceremonial Bell. Giant turtle who feeds on flames. Psychic Kappa. What does his say? An amphibian with a myriad of powers to shield it from enemy attacks. A myriad of powers. Very cool. We got a Curse of Fiend. The Crab Turtle. There he is. Rising Air Current. And the Giant Rat. We have returned to the Raiders of Metal, the Metal Raiders. Inside lays one of the strongest cards ever made, the Pequeno Moth, which we now have a first edition PSA 10 Petite Moth. We're looking for that Pequeno Moth still, though. We got the Oguchi. Love to see that guy, the Disc Magician. Queen's Double. Oh! Ho, ho, and the Legendary. This small but deadly creature is better off avoided, and you you best avoid this sucker because this thing is amazing. So let's pull that guy out. Tremendous fire. That's an amazing pull. Dragon Piper, Tainted Wisdom, and the Blade Fly. So we got the best card in the set there. We cannot complain. We are back to the Invasion of Chaos. The Chaos. Can it be invaded? We've been looking to do that. We, well, we did invade with the uh, of Darkness, the Invader of Darkness. The Neo Bug. Salvage. Sylphid. Recycle, Boganian, Primal Seed, Grinmaju, Dayiza, and the DD Scout Plane. We love to see the DD Scout Plane. Always shows its face in an Invasion of Chaos opening. Very odd how that always happens. Spell Ruler. We're skipping Pharaoh Servant because we only have one left. We're going to save that. Uh, we had less Pharaoh Servant than the rest besides LOB. So one, two, three, four. 
Let's go to The Fickle. The Tailor of the Fickle. Performance of Sword. Hamburger Recipe. Eat Gaboon. Fairy Sand Mirror. Umiruka. Flash Assailant. Invader of the Throne. A super rare Invader of the Throne. Snatch Steel if you are able to flip this sucker up, but uh, can't be activated in the battle phase. So, uh, not very good. It would have been pretty good, theoretically, if it could have been activated in the battle phase. Uh, really good, actually. You just set that sucker and just take their monster. Um, but yeah, they didn't want it to be that good, so <laughs> they just made Snatch Deal the next uh, set and made it even better. We got a King of ya Yami Makai. Why did I see an in there? We got the Gazelle. Armed Lazar. The Immortal Thunder. We could pull another Picanium off. Sword of Deep Seated. Rock Ogre Grotto. Number one. So they made this guy number one before they even made number two, I guess. That's interesting. Leg Hole. And Share the Pain. Mooka Mook. We are down to one of each pack left besides Invasion of Chaos. We have two of those. So we're going to do two in a row here for Invasion of Chaos. Let's make the chaos. We've been looking to, ca to chaos the entire time. Ojama Black. The Prickle Fairy. Griffin's Feather Duster. Granadura. Gigantis. Jade Insect Whistle. The Chaos Sork. Very good one. DD Borderline. I think that was it. And the Drilago. Wah, wah, wah. Five more packs in the opening. So far, pretty good. I would say pretty good opening. We've got a Secret Rare. We've got an Ultra. we got a bunch of Supers. It's gone fairly well. It hasn't gone crazy, though. So let's see if we can really turn it up a notch here with the Torpedo Fish. Probably not going to do it. Terra King Salmon. we got the Ojama Delta Hurricane. Soul Absorption. Boganian. Stealth Bird. Soul Tigre. And the Orca Mega Fortress of Darkness. Another one that tends to show up in Invasion of Chaos openings. DD Scout Plane and Orca Mega Fortress. I think DD is a little bit more popular, but that one's close. Now we are on to the Servant of Pharaohs. We have not pulled Jinzo in quite a while. We used to pull Jinzo like every single time, and it has been a while. Let's see if we can do it here. The Burning Land. Thousand Eyes Idol. Dark Fire Soldier, the number two. Solemn Wishes. Kurochin Kuwagata. Earthshaker. Souls of the Forgotten is the next one. Yeah, we get the Morphing Jar number two. And World Suppression. Okay, we're suppressing the world. We're not pulling anything. On to the final three packs of the first packs ever made. These were all in 2002. So was Ferris Servant, but we forgot to mention that one. But this one, third set, main set, I should say, ever made. Spell Ruler was Magic Ruler. Change the Spell Ruler. You guys know that. Two, three, four, because, you know, Magic the Gathering got a little salty. We've got Dark Zebra, Guy Power, Luminous Spark. Chain Energy, Red Archery Girl, got the Crab Turtle, Metafish, Reliable Guardian, and a Mother Grizzly. Okay, nothing in there, but that's okay because we have two more packs. We have Metal Raiders. Let's pull ourselves another Pequeno Moth, the moth that is deadly and better off avoided. Here we go, King of Yami Makai. He became a King of Yami Makai. Bottom Dweller, we got the Pumpkin the King of Ghosts. Yeah, that was that... Panic voice at one grade. Soul release. I need to practice that. Mushroom man number two. Wait, is there a mushroom man number one? I don't think there is. Is there? Maybe it's in a tournament pack? I don't know. Trent. We've got a guy from Lord of the Rings. Block attack. Elegant. Egotist. Final pack. Legend of Blue Eyes. This is the only Legend of Blue Eyes pack we have in this opening. So if there is a Blue Eyes White Dragon in here, we're going to lose it. Here we go. We did pull one the other day. It was pretty cool. So one, two, three, four. Let's do that. Final pack of the opening, M Warrior number one. He's the first M Warrior. We got the Remove Trap, Dissolve Rock. Oh, we, we rocked some special, but that's okay. Mizurizame. Wait. Oh, we did it back. We because we did that. Oh, never mind. There isn't a Yame. It'll have to be after this. Nope. Root Water. Unfortunately, the old school pack. So it would be Yame. Umi. Oh wait. Here we go. Metal Dragon and. You, Robbie, are the second highest attack monster as a four star that you can actually play. So, uh, okay, maybe not what we were looking for. Overall, it was a fun opening. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to subscribe for more epic old school openings because they will be happening on this channel. Shout out to TCG, Trust Cards, Tone, Fosho, Tomato Juice, Noah J, Stanley, Mike, Nance, Mimic, Gecko, Duelist, Game Cards, Bank of It, Farland, and G Raider. Thank you guys for supporting this channel, and I will see you guys next time. Peace.